Hi guys, it's Joan from Joan Kennedy Artist. I hope you're well today. I just wanted to pop on and talk to you about my little redhead. Um, this is a painting that I've absolutely loved doing um, because I love foxes and uh, it's been hugely popular because so obviously there's a lot of people out there who also love foxes. Before I explain to you where the name came from, would you mind giving us a few hearts, a few thumbs up and maybe even share it? Now, um, I've just popped on because the original um, I sold uh, a few years ago to Emily and um, I was just chatting to her on Facebook and I said to her, um, you know, is it still going strong? And and so she very kindly sent me a photograph, which I will put in uh, the the actual original photo in the um, the bottom uh, when we're finished. But um, she when she, when we were chatting, hi Elisa, how you doing? Um, when we were um, chatting, I said to her, did I ever tell you about the story behind the name? A little redhead and she said no so rather than me trying to explain it all I thought you know what I'll come on video and then she can find out and also it can help everybody else who has bought this image in its many forms um, I've, I sell it as a cushion um, and I sell it as a really high quality print which obviously this one is this is what's called a G clay print which uh, it won't fade it'll last you well over a hundred years it's done in heritage water paper um, watercolour paper I should say. So how does the name A Little Redhead came about? Simply because I, as well as painting, I teach babies and toddlers through music and I have parents with their child development and I've been doing that for the past 19 years now, um, helping children and they've all, lots of them have obviously grown up because music I'm passionate just as much about music and how it helps helps us as I am about painting. And there is one mum who has bought, one art collector now, who's bought many of my paintings and many of my pieces of work um, in the past. Her name is Jane. And she has a little boy who's called Jack. And when she came around to collect some art from me before, she um, he, he came along as well, because I hadn't seen him in, in years. You know, he'd come to me when he was only about one or two years of age and I didn't see him till he was probably about six or seven at least. So um, it was just fabulous just to see him. But anyway, he very quietly said to me, I love foxes, absolutely love foxes. And I'd love if you painted a fox. So that's how it came about. That's how I started my journey on painting a fox. The camera is actually, as I'm looking at it, the painting is back to front. So in fact, it is, if you see on my my website you'll see the um the, the proper way around i don't know how i'm um, you know with, with technology and facebook it just it just makes me go hi stephanie how you doing nice to see you on here so um so that's why it's called a little redhead and i hope that people get as much enjoyment which i think they do out of the painting um as i did in painting it because i absolutely adored painting it. What I also will do is in the post in below, I will put um, the photograph um, of the of the fox that I painted it from so you can see the two um, because it, again it was gifted uh, a very kind uh, photographer had taken the painting, the picture and had gifted it to people to be able to use. So that's it, it's called A Little Redhead. Pop over to my website www joankennedyartist.co.uk um, and you can you can see it again I'll put it in the description so if you know anyone else who loves foxes this one is definitely a winner for a lot of people all right so thanks for watching have a great day take care bye